Oh, hey there, Internet. Uh, I'm Tony Bacigalupo, and I'm experimenting with something new, which is to share stuff that I'm working on as I'm working on it to see if it might be fun for you to follow along. Um, I find that it helps a lot if I'm not alone while I'm doing this, even if it's just kind of talking through what I'm doing. And so I thought maybe I would see what it would look like to do it with you kind of hanging out with me. I tend to learn some new things and uh, sharing the creative process tends to be a pretty good thing for everybody. So uh, I've benefited a lot from watching other people work. So maybe you'll benefit from watching me work. So um, today I'm working on a new little book that I've been thinking about for a little while that's going to involve illustrations and tips specifically for folks who are working on starting new co-working spaces. I have a number of other products and services that I've been developing over the years, but um, I'm noticing that what people really have needs around are um, things around, you know, starting co-working space. Should I start one? How should I go about it? That kind of thing. And I've got a lot of tips built up, but I want to have a specific product, particularly an affordable one, that can give people just give people a, just a really easy way to get started, and also to get them kind of on board with what I'm doing, and pave the way to them being customers that I can help in more substantial capacities. Um, so this actually started out as um, a little thing that I had in my notebook here, where. I just kind of like, uh, do, 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 do. I had this little notion of like, have these, these truths and, and then these little doodles. Oh, is it going to focus? No. Okay. Um, and so I started to run with that and I started kind of coming up with all these different illustrations and imageries of what it would look like for different tips. So then, even like funny things, like, oh yes, it's also cow orking, where a cow sticks its nose in your camera's face right when you're about to take a picture, those kinds of things. Um, a few bits about sustainable models for co-working spaces, which I know is a very common and important thing. And you can see here, just a bunch more little illustrations, and then sometimes I just end up, um, sometimes I end up just writing stuff. Oh man focus you can do it oh yeah i want to get this focus stuff figured out do, 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 do. so yeah got a bunch of pages of stuff which is cool i also have um some notes from my so as i've been going i've been kind of noting particular bits that i want to share um and starting to outline it so whether i write it in a notebook first or write it in here first i just want to make sure i have all of it documented and I'm starting to organize. So the bolds, the bold faces are kind of section headers. Orange ones are just random ones that haven't been placed yet. As you can see, I'm up to 70 right now. So um, I figure if I can get to 100, then I've definitely got a book's worth of stuff. Uh, and right now I'm at, uh, I'm at 70 and I honestly just got started. Oops, that's where we're going later. Actually, I'll just show you now. So this is Pages, Pages file, uh, the, the standard stock Mac OS thingy. I'm just going to move me to, uh oh, I'm going to move me to the corner here so you can see me while I work here. Do, 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 do. Doing it live, guys. Okay, here you go. Okay, and so um, I just created like a super, super simple template here to work with and left uh, myself some blank pages but then you can kind of see how the beginning of this has come together where we're going to have very simple illustration very simple short piece of text and it's going to be even kind of a little slideshow presentation style i'm actually thinking of doing a live video presentation of the book that maybe would be included in the book so you can actually hear me narrate it and provide a little additional commentary. That's probably going to mean I'm going to need to recreate this whole thing in a keynote, but I am not too concerned about that at this point. If I can get this done, I'll be really happy. So um, 
you kind of get a vibe for where I'm going here with this. I'm gonna center these things. Man, I wish pages let you create consistent page guides. You can do this thing where you can, you know, create these guides, but then there's no way to perpetuate them across other pages, which is super annoying, but that's okay. We're gonna work with it. So yeah, these are some graphics I've created. I am using a, oh, you can't see me. Here I am. Okay, I'm gonna switch this so you can see me even as I'm working. You see, much better now. Um, I'm using a Wacom tablet that I got for my birthday. Very happy with it, Intuos. Um, it's got those fancy little dots, little implement. I gotta get used to the fact that Apple is reversing me. So like my right is your left, it's kind of strange. Anyway, um, I really like drawing. I draw on paper, but um, being able to draw straight onto the digital is really nice. So just to show you, I did start on pen and paper. Um, so I've kind of created these on paper first just to get kind of a vibe for how these are going to look. And a couple of things we're going to do a lot about calendaring. And these are like the different sustainable models that I showed you earlier in my sketchbook. So I've got kind of like notebook, sketchbook, and then digital. Sometimes I skip over, sometimes I go straight in. The ones that I just showed you in my sketchbook, I use these Posca paint pens. These things are like my best friends. I love these things. These are, um, they draw on like any surface. They really bold, clear lines. So I'm a big fan of the Posca paint pens. So all of this is my setup and I'm realizing that this might work just as a little video unto itself. I am playing some music in the background, so I'm very curious to hear if any of that is coming through on the audio levels, and I'm hoping that I don't get into any copyright trouble there. I'm assuming that me talking over it the whole time is going to keep me safe there, but hopefully this won't be too much of a distraction. Um, this particular playlist that you're listening to now is my Spotify weekly uh, recommended list, so there you go. All right, I'm gonna stop it there and the next video will be me actually doing some of the illustration work and just kind of discussing my process as I go. Hope you enjoyed, thanks.